going on guys and welcome back to another Meet the Queens video now I'm gonna put it out there and I'm gonna say yeah this is probably the most weirdest start to a vlog ever well our vlogs anyway basically yeah we've been away in Blackpool for the past two days and we're leaving today yeah. but we're starting the vlog today does that make any sense? it don't really make sense it don't make no sense guys we just had yeah a little family break away we had some friends come down with us so we just literally chilled out we went on the theme park went on some rides and do you know what we didn't vlog it do you know why? it rained we literally rained all day yesterday so we just went on a couple of rides with the kids we have spent majority of the time in the hotel room just chilling and relaxing and just just recouping and just being somewhere different so that is why we are starting the vlog today we thought we'll start it today and then we'll go home we've got things going on but yeah we're not explain any more to what i just said not really but to be honest you guys have seen us at blackpool loads of times i know we've vlogged it so many times yeah us at blackpool so it's like same just, go watch, just go watch an old vlog exactly. exactly same old same. thing i don't really do rides anyway do you know what i mean so you wouldn't see me on no rides Melo went on a few rides but nothing major did you there were major there were major rides the Bob's one. did you go on this one that one up there that huge one that's see that huge one there did you go on that one there yeah why didn't you do it then i wasn't ready that's what i'm saying you went on a few rides you went on a few rides he never usually does so that made that made a change for him last time he hardly went on any rides yeah true but this time he actually went on rides true. i was quite shocked to be fair yeah yeah it's true. Ma, you went on a few rides as well, didn't you? Yeah. Which was your favourite ride? And the count of three will say at the same time. Three, two, one. The horsey ride. I knew he was going to say that. I thought that was fast, you know. It was fast. It was quick, innit? Yeah, it was super quick. Considering it's for kids and stuff like that, I had to hold on tight. I thought I was going to come off the horse. Okay. No joke. What ride did you do? Um, I did not blue one. Oh, the blue ride. Yeah, that's yeah, decent. That's down. decent. He's quite like me. Lorenzo don't really do rides either. Hey, do you know what I mean? Hey, 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 hey. hey, like hey. Huh? I want to keep it like that. Well. You want to keep it like that as well? Yeah. Ah, I don't know, man. Don't be boring. Some rides I think you could have done. Do you know I what I mean? Go to my hey, hey, I don't do rides. Listen, hey, hey, I've, I've hey. experienced the worst of the worst rides and I never have to go through that ever again. Simple. Tiago, what rides have you been on? Did you go on a ride? Guys, this kid was a straight up nightmare. He was. He cried, yeah, the whole time. When he was on the ride, okay. he was fine. Cried when he got off, cried when he got on. He was okay while he was on it. We literally all day he was stressed. <laughs> molding, molding. He was stressed. He looked, yeah, stressed because he like okay. he just like he wanted to go, but yeah. he didn't want to go. He's, He's one of the yet. mad over cautious kids. I took him on a train ride, a simple train ride around a the theme park, and you must have seen him the way he was observing the train before we got on it. Honestly, it was crazy. We have a good time, Shnucky. Yeah. Yeah. Was it good? Yeah. You didn't go on much rides, did you? No, I did. did. She went on the most out of all of the uh, all of the little ones. Oh, did you? She even I'll take that back then. I went on a ride that she went on last time. Cried. Oh really? Ah, yeah, oh, my cried. days. No, no, let me no, tell you a story. No, no, <laughs> let me tell you a story. No, no, no. <laughs> Guys, let me tell you a funny, funny story. We went somewhere. I think it was Western. It was Western Superman. And on the pier, you can go inside and like they have some rides and stuff in there. Anyways, Sienna wants to go on this ride. One of the ones that you sit in and it pushes you up and down, up and down. And the way she was going on, no, I want to go on a ride. No, no, I'll be fine. No, I want to go on a ride. Kicking up a fuss and all that. Well, all right then. Let's let her go on a ride. As that ride goes past. And what happened when you got on the ride, Sienna? After all that kicking up a fuss, what happened when you got on the ride? I was brave. You enough. cried your eyes out the whole time in the ride. <laughs> I swear I've got footage somewhere. I'm going to have to look for the footage, see if I can find it. <laughs> Start the ride. Start the ride, remember? <laughs> Hey! <laughs> I'm telling you, I would proper rate the geezer that rides that train because he yeah. has energy yeah. all day. He yeah, literally baby. will wave every single time he comes past this whole entire room. It's mad. So we literally have had the same room we have every single time, guys. It's literally a room that has a sofa bed there. It has a king size bed here. And then you walk here as you're walking out. And it has bunk beds here. We had two of these rooms. We had an interconnecting room. So this door here, here, opened up and there was exactly the same room on the other side and Romello and Lorenzo in that room there. So we had plenty of space, the door was open. Tiago slept in there one night as well with Mello, so you could just like go through. It's nice, because we had so many people in the rooms, it was nice to have that extra bit of space and Marcelo has literally been crawling around like a madman the whole time. So we are on our way out. Tiago, off you go, man. I don't know what you're doing with that Nintendo Switch as well. I do not trust you with the Nintendo Switch. Yeah. Guys, the weather has been an absolute disgrace. And today, it's continued. Look at the sky, man. This is summer. Guys, we're in July at the moment. Absolutely mad. Ah, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't trust him with the switch, man. He's going to drop it, guys. He's going to drop it. Someone take the switch off him, man. Hello. What is going on? Is that the new trend then, yeah? What? Is that the new Birmingham flex? What? The jeans going to the socks. The whole grey look. Is that what you're doing, yeah? Oh, <laughs> Bike. 
Oh yeah, look at the wheels on this bike, man. Tires are massive. Right, we don't know what we're doing, guys. We don't know whether to just go home or stay and go to the arcade for a bit or something. I don't know what to do, man. To be honest, I want to go home, but let's see what everybody else wants to do. What do you want to do? Go home. Are you going to go home? Yeah. All right then, see you now. Arcade. Arcades. Yep. Melo, what are you saying? Go home or arcades? There's nothing much in the arcade. There's nothing there, is there? Go home. It's alright? Arcades. Ty. Go home. Go home, so go home wins. Yes. <laughs> you wanna go home as well? He's been saying he wants to go home since the morning. Sorry, Sienna man, you lost a vote. It is what it is though, isn't it? <laughs> And check out the boot space, guys. The boot space <laughs> is an absolute joke. This is absolutely crazy. So I've got one of my bags here. I've got another one of my bags here. And I've got another bag um, which has to go in mum's car. So make sure that goes in there because that bag ain't going to fit in his boot. It's crazy. Only two bags, man, can oh, fit yeah. in. It's mad. And I just went to put my shades on and both of the lenses just popped out. Yeah, the shades, the lenses. Someone's been messing with my gutty, so I've got no... Shade. What the hell? I know, yeah. They're it's brand crazy. new. I know they are. And they're Gucci. I've got them in my pocket, but do you know what I mean? Hopefully they just slap back in. <laughs> you, you, you're pranking me. I swear down. I picked them up. Melo, you see? Yeah. I picked them up and they both just fell out. No joke. So hopefully they fit back in. Oh my god. What the hell? So as per usual, my car is fully stocked with every single suitcase and bag and whatever. And I've also got to put this, the push chair down and put it in. Everything's always left to me, you know. Always left to me. So guys, I've been playing Pokemon right now. Pokemon is the best game you'll ever see right now. Look, I'm reversing another gym challenger. Yeah. Literally, she's yeah, really I'm hard. I'm with Pokemon yeah. music though. That's yeah. all I would have done if it's I was better than Fortnite and Minecraft. It's definitely better than Fortnite. Fortnite is different. Of course, definitely better. Yep. So that's you for the journey home then, yeah? Yeah. All right, cool, cool. Right, we're leaving to go home now, guys, and we're going to stop off at a service station probably about halfway, man. So uh, I'll probably catch you at the service station. If not, I'll catch you back at home. So I have to felt like at least four hours plus, which is only two hours, we are back home. And my gosh, does it feel good to be home. Anytime you go away, even if it's for one night, yeah, when you get home, if you just feel like, <sighs> like you can fully chill even though you go on holiday to chill out when you get back you just i don't know it's really weird guys i don't know if i'm the only person probably some of you guys feel the same way i just feel like when i'm home i'm just like yeah i'm home but then the kids start complaining in the morning and carrying on and i'm like gosh i need a holiday you know how it goes guys how good is it to be home oh it's really good to be home. how good really i'm just saying you go away yeah because you want to relax but when yeah. you get home you just feel more yeah. calmer. calmer and you know what the good thing about it is we left the house in a decent shape. We should, yeah, we always no, do. Sometimes we're rushing around, there's clothes that ain't been sorted out, it's been left and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't even That know. kind of stuff. This time, everything's just in order when we come back. Yeah. We're rushing around. Yeah. Come back and chill. How good is that? It's so good. The reason why that is, guys, is because the kids did not actually know that we was like going to Blackpool until like near the end. So I managed to plan everything and get everything sorted out and everything yeah, prepped beforehand so it was much much easier but yeah so we're back we're gonna unload the car see if already unloaded dad's car and clean it out i've got to do my car which is the worst car because it has the most stuff but yeah i'm gonna sort that out and get everything unloaded and put in the washing machine and then probably feed these kids because they're gonna be hungry again oh my gosh he's in his bedroom and he's not playing roblox He's not watching Dragon Ball Z. He's not playing Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Oh He's actually watching football. What is going on here? Mm -hmm. huh? watching it. What's made you all of a sudden I watch, watch football? football? No, you don't. I swear my life it. Don't swear any life. I told I you about do. doing that. I don't do. swear any life. I watch you always, every time. Listen, there's no point in lying because everybody can see you lying. Every time I walk in this bedroom, you're playing Dragon Ball Z on Roblox. What every single time. No, I watch football. You never watch football. Yeah, What's this you watching then anyway? Some stupidness. What's this? Comedy football moments. The funniest football moments. Yeah. Any good? Yeah, it's so funny. Yeah. yeah. And we're in the dungeon. Back at home and instantly back in the room yeah. and on a game. Am I correct in saying that? Yeah. Though it even need to look at the screen or can I just assume it's a game? Yeah, it's not a game. It's not a game? No. Hey? Yeah. Auto trader. Yeah. <laughs> The auto trader. What are you doing in the auto trader, kid? Uh, <laughs> honestly, wait, you're, so, you're talking about like something when we was driving to to, to Blackpool. Yes. Like cars and stuff. Yeah. So basically, I was thinking that I might as well just start having a look now, innit? That's right. Yeah. That's so. right. I give Mello a lecture and a half. 
The lecture went on for about 50 minutes, guys. 50 minutes, man. Was you actually listening to the lecture? Yeah. Well, yes, you was listening to the lecture. Now, the lecture was about... Do you know what? I'll let you tell them what the lecture was about, actually. You so, tell them. So, basically, it was talking about how my YouTube is at the moment and, like, what would it be like in the future? Exactly. So, like, will I be doing the same thing? Yeah. Or will I be doing something different? Exactly. It's, like, uh, it's talking about, what like, what adults are doing right now. Yeah. But kids aren't doing so exactly like, do that platform with kids then obviously. exactly totally different. that's right because at the moment obviously metal has a gaming channel and for a lot of you guys that don't know metal likes to play games yeah but he doesn't necessarily like to make videos about games so it's, it's a bit different isn't it yeah. it's like going to work like going to work you don't really want to go to work do you you just want to chill do you know what I'm trying to say? But when you're playing a game for YouTube, it's a bit like work, isn't it? Because yeah. you got to talk and stuff. Then you got to edit the video. you got to think of things to do all the time. And he never really enjoys that. One thing that Melo does enjoy, as you can see by the helmet in the background, yeah, the Nico Rosberg helmet, as who's crying? Who's tired? Of? Marcelo! Yeah. Jeez! Yeah. yeah. You love cars? Yeah. Don't you? Mm -hmm. Which means, do you know what I mean? Yeah. You've got to make sure you're working towards that. If you want to do a car YouTube channel, you got to work towards it from now. Have ideas about what you want to do. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because as I was saying, guys, some people that do YouTube now with their kids or whatever, um, they think about now and they're not actually thinking about the future. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. you got to think about the future. Kids get old. The people that watched you three, four years ago are still not going to be watching Fortnite in three, four years' time. Are they? No. They're going to grow up with you, isn't it? Yeah. They're going to be driving cars. So you got to make sure you're on the right track. Do you know what I'm saying? If that's something you want to do. And I think it's the right thing to do because you love cars. Yeah. So, Melo is currently looking at cars to start a little car project. But why are you looking at BMW? Why have you gone BMW? I don't oh, get that. I went, no, I found a Nissan. A Nissan what? 350Z. How much is that? 5,000. No, too much. Too much. Listen. Listen, I said, guys, I said. No, you didn't even no, say no, a budget. I, got, I didn't say a budget, yeah, but I'm going to say a budget okay. now. That's right. I said I help him out with a little car to start a little project. Do you know what I mean? So he can do the, the research about the car. We can kick the car off. And on his 17th birthday, he can drive the car for the first time. It'll be a very, very fun YouTube product, yeah. isn't it? People would like to see that. But we never spoke about the budget. So I think now is the time to speak about Melo's car project budget. You know what I mean? And I'm thinking you can go halves as well. Don't think all this yeah, money's yeah. coming in from me. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I think you can go halves. Yeah, I was just telling the guys that we're looking to buy a car for Melo's projects that's right because as we've said before Melo is going to start a car channel that's right he's not going to be doing Fortnite his whole life he's going to switch it up and he's going to be doing a channel about cars but he's not going to just take money from us we're not just going to pay for the car he needs to go halves with the car at least do you know what I'm saying and whatever he puts in we can at least match I think that's fair what do you think this is all new to me by the way guys. <laughs> see guys you're hearing this yeah I'm hearing it okay so this is new to me yeah it is so where's this car going the car's going on the drive what do you me? But there's no space. There's space in the drive. Don't what kind me. of car is it going to be? It's only going to be a runner. Look up, you know what I mean? That's what I mean. Up and stuff. Not a major. No. You're going to be driving the car. We're going to be kitting the car up for YouTube videos. Listen. That's what's going to happen. I'm not having no clapped out car on my drive. Do you mean? Spill oil oh, you all watched over the place. GTI the other day. I know you that is a school. classic car. Yeah. It's not clapped out. Them cars are expensive. Yeah. I'm not having no oil leaking yet. Gross <laughs> bucket sitting on my drive. Listen, no. don't worry about that. We'll find a place for it to go. You need, you know what you we'll need to do? To go. You need to get a rented garage because you can rent garages. You can rent garages. My house is. Yeah, but they're going to be secure and stuff. Wow. But anyways, anyways, forget that. Now we're going to speak about the budget because, as I said, he needs to go half into this. Yeah. We're not just going to be putting money into this thing and then the, Dude, pad why, the project why, has failed. Why are we putting money into it full stuff? Uh, are we putting money and we're going to get Rupi back. Yes, that's right. You will pay us back the money from the earnings of the YouTube videos. Yeah, along. Do you understand? Alone. You can't little, just... Do you know what I mean? This alone. is what it is. The car that we're going for now isn't going to be your first car. Yeah. This is not your car. Yeah. The car that you get obviously is going to come from us. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Because obviously we've all worked on this together. Isn't that correct? Can I interject just for one second? None of you know how to put cars together. Yeah, so yeah. what? Man, no, you don't you have a think clue. You, do. you don't have a clue. Nathan, didn't you buy a book for your car one time and you ended up just taking it to the a garage? Book? Do you have know, you know books you got? I just wanted to face. read the book. I didn't want to actually no, do it no, to no. it. <laughs> I didn't you want to do it for a car. Yeah. Because he was going to do some stuff to the car. Yeah. yeah I don't know. You know I know. Now, do you know what? It's minor. We ain't got to do nothing ourselves anyway. All we're going to do, yeah, yeah is get the car. You're going to get the car. Yeah. You're going to decide on what modifications is right for the car. Yeah. yeah based off a budget. Yeah. We're going to take it to the garage, yeah. buy the parts for the car, yeah. and we're going to get that stuff done. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to sell it for a profit. Ain't no big thing. Ain't it, Matt? What do you think? 
Yeah, so, no. let's talk budgets. Yes. I thought he was just going to review cars, like new cars. Yeah, he's going to do that. Well. Listen, and... listen. When you do a car channel, you can do all sorts of car related things. Probably don't have to just... we don't have to buy anything. Listen, we can just go we're not look, talking look big cars. money. We're not talking big money. We're talking a project. Something that we know you can make a profit on. That's the best thing about it. Something that you can make a profit on. So, budget, what are you saying, Perthy? £500. £500. <laughs> Why would you buy us and probably have him? No, like the whole car. All in! 250 or 250 Go to the scrapyard and get a scrapyard. <laughs> what are you saying? 500 pound? I know, yeah? 500 pound? No? no? I don't know. I'm going to say budget of... I'm going to say one and a half. What, from, from all whole? All in. 750 or 750 U. That sounds fair. To start with, he's yeah. looking at 350 Zs, yeah. five grand and all that. Yeah, what? what are you doing? Yeah. No. Oh. No. You can't be doing that. Who? Who, yeah? What is this aiming at? Are you aiming at kids or This is the, the thing as well. Man, like I told you in the lecture in the car, yeah? yeah? You need to be aiming towards kids, well, teenagers at your age, the kind of cars that they would drive. You know what I mean? Kitted out like Novas and stuff and <laughs> What else did they drive? Golf GTIs. No, nope. not even oh. that. Polo GTIs. Not even that. No. Polos, not GTI. Polo and Old Fiestas, Corsas. Them are the kind of cars you should be looking at. Do you know what I'm trying to say? The That's your target audience. The KAs and that. But, oh the my old God. Ones. Yeah, the K. Should we kiss up a K? That would be sick still. You can't get in a K. I oh, know. <laughs> So I'm gonna say between one and a half and two thousand, but you've got to match half of that. Simple, okay? Yeah. I think that sounds fair. I don't know. To be fair, yeah, I ain't got nothing to do with it. To be fair, I don't want anything to do with it. Yeah. I don't want any money. I don't want anything about any parts. I just don't want any mess. <laughs> Mello, it's gonna be two grand, okay? Yeah. And you must fund the parts yourself. Do you understand me? You will do the research, yeah? You will get the paint. Anything that gets done to the car, you will sort out with your own money. Is that fair? Yeah. Do you know what, guys? I don't even know if it's a good idea or not to do this car thing. I don't know if it's a good idea because Melo, he's still in that kid mentality. Like, he'll start things and then just, just leave it or he'll forget about doing stuff because obviously life is just too easy for him at the moment. I was also saying to Melo, do you know what he needs to do? He needs to go to work for like three or four months. That's what he needs to do. He needs to go to work and then come back, yeah? And then he needs to see what the real world is like. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Because these kids, man, because they've got it so easy at the moment. They just think everything it's just nice, plain sailing, stuff like that. They've never been told what to do. They never had to get up and go to work and that in the morning. So it'd be good for him to get out and go to work. But if you think, guys, if you think that he should get this car and we should do these projects and give it a go, then I want you to leave a like on this video and comment what car you think you should do, what car we should start with, something sensible, and we'll we'll make it happen. We'll make it happen. Fat man, what are you eating? Hey, what are you doing? Uh, yeah, look at the state of this room. This is Tiago's room and there's Lego bricks everywhere, man. I'm telling you, everywhere. Guys, I'm going to quickly, yeah, go through a couple of questions. People are asking, yeah, on my Instagram because I put up a post. What happened to the pranks? And the oh, Greer no, Olympics? Oh, yeah. The Greer Olympics. So, I think oh it's my to be EM51 has asked, how come the prank wars have stopped and also the Greer Olympics? We gotta do that, you know. We gotta do that. The Green Olympics stopped for a bit because we were struggling because of the weather and stuff yeah. like that. And not only that, we were struggling to to get like equipment to do the stuff in, in the, the garden, garden yeah. because of lockdown. But obviously, lockdown is not like lockdown anymore, no, so we no. can actually start that again. We can start doing. But that. nevertheless, the weather is still crazy outside. I mean, Shabby. look at the rain on the windows. It's absolutely it horrible outside. Well, yeah, prank wars. Yeah, what happened with prank wars? It's Listen, all me. Nothing that happened with prank wars. I will get my revenge very, very soon. Don't worry about that. I think I'm gonna end up doing the prank before he comes. We'll to see. Me. What are you, boy? Anything yeah. you want to do? Do you know what I mean? Metal starting, gonna start a new channel and that with cars um, and stuff. What you want to do, kids? A channel, yeah. Yeah. So I learn stuff. What do you mean? Like, you want to start another new channel? No chance. Well, not no chance Absolutely no I chance. You want to learn new stuff? You want to learn new stuff? What do you want to learn, boy? What? He doesn't even know. He doesn't even know. He's just I talking did. garbage. Oh, yeah. Just I go did. on, go and watch it. Go. go. Language, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I want to learn languages. Yeah, yeah, you can do that though. What are you waiting for? Do you um, know what I mean? You can do that instead of paying Roblox. Uh -huh. I'll give you a clue for the next one. Yeah, go on. Go and think about it. Off you go. Off you go, kid. Did <laughs> 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 you see what was in it? What's it in about? Oh, gymnastics or backflicks? Yeah, backflicks. Oh, you want to oh, do that? No, you're not doing no backflicks. Why? No. Yeah, I don't trust. It's dangerous. No backflicks. Oh, Backflip mat that you had, remember? Oh my days, we bought, before. yes, we bought a backflip mat. Yeah, I know. How much was that? Like 400 pounds? 450. 450, yeah. He tried to do a backflip once, didn't do it, wasted it. No. So, it is, because of that, is, because of that, that's it. No, it's not happening. On my Instagram, someone asked a message saying, how is Marcelo and Tiago getting on? Oh yeah. Tiago getting on his room. Oh, oh in the room and that. Oh, listen. Might as well say Tiago doesn't stop in here at all. No. He's, he, Nathan puts him in here, he goes to sleep while he's already asleep. But he has never slept the whole night through. He hasn't. No, he has. But he got up like six o'clock in the morning. So he did sleep the night. 
Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's, it's just not working. Well, that's only been once. And even Marcelo is getting worse in the car. So I don't know what's going on with this guy. I think, I don't yeah. know. Might have to put this bed at the bottom of our bed. Either that or put it in Lorenzo's room. Nah, because he doesn't like staying in Lorenzo's room. You took him apart. I take him into Lorenzo's room yeah. sometimes in the middle of the night when he's crying. Put him in Lorenzo's bed because Lorenzo's got a big double bed. And he comes back crying into you the bedroom. the only person he sleeps with. Mello. Is Mello. That's the only person. Well, we in Blackpool, obviously. Yeah. He went and slept with Mello because Mello yeah. had a king size bed to his side. That's fine. And they sleep like this together. Yeah, I know, yeah. But face that, to face. And he sleeps <laughs> I know. the whole night through. I know, I know. But he can't do that. Nah, he can't be doing that. I know, yeah. Baby sleeping. Yeah, he doesn't mind. He don't mind, but nah, what? he nah, needs to. We just gotta keep cracking, man. But we're gonna keep trying. Simple. Keep consistent. So that's the update on the boys in the rooms. Uh, Marcelo is struggling in the cup, but we're gonna keep pushing through. And Tiago, yeah. Struggle boss is real. So, anyways, on that note, guys, we are gonna end the video there, man. And do you know what? I forgot to mention, I'm really, really annoyed with YouTube at the moment. Really, really annoyed because Tara had done something at the start of last videos to do with butterflies and caterpillars, basically, to determine how long you guys have been watching the channel. And once again, YouTube shut our comments off. We had like 3,000 comments, yeah, in like 10 minutes. And then YouTube just decided to shut it off when we got to 4,500 comments. It is crazy. We're gonna probably do some sort of poll some sort of, I don't know, some sort of petition, some sort of petition, that's right, because we want our comments back on YouTube. There's no reason why our comment section should be up. It's just not fair, man, it's just not fair. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll be back, probably tomorrow, actually, with another video, so I will see you then. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram and all that good stuff, and you can also check us out on Facebook, where we're gonna be showing like loads of short videos on there, so make sure you check that out, guys, and I will catch you in the next video, in a bit.